Einstein Infinite Do's and Don'ts. iGlaucoma presents Make Success Surgical Secrets Season 3, a video series sponsored by Alcon, Glaucos, and Sight Sciences. Number 1. Do rotate the head approximately 25 degrees and microscope approximately 25 degrees to get in a comfortable temporal position with a good on-face view to begin. Don't attempt implantation with a flat, under-rotated gonio view. It distorts anatomy, risking incorrect stent placement above or below the TM landmark. Number two. Do ensure the eye is well pressurized with cohesive viscoelastic. Don't apply too much pressure with gonio prism, as this can create striae and negatively impact your view. Number three, do aim the trocar at the center of the trabecular meshwork with high magnification, 10 to 12 X. Don't aggressively dimple the meshwork, as this can result in over implantation Ideally, create a light dimple as you penetrate the TM. Number four, do pause, then squeeze the stent delivery button to deploy the stent and continue to hold the stent delivery button down while slowly pulling the injector straight back. Don't release the delivery button too soon as it can dislodge the stent. Number five, do use the cannula's side or forceps to study unsteady stent insertions. Don't singulate before the first stent is implanted, and remember to singulate before the second and third stent placements. For a comprehensive guide to overcoming common eye stent insertion challenges, check out our eye stent video playlist. And for more valuable content, subscribe to the Eye Glaucoma YouTube channel. I'm your host, Dr. Constance Okeke, signing off.